find that spot where that hair is going to. I promise this works. I've done it on Asian hair, thick hair, thin hair, slippery hair, long, short. Um, we don't want it, and don't use any gel when you're, because you're going to have, they're going to have to sleep in this. Really, I think 10 hours is probably the least to really get them to set. Um, it's not super comfortable. They're going to have to learn to sleep on their face. But they've got 30 hours, so they'll survive. So do it so that it's just that ponytail just after where the crown comes down. And just use a hair color elastic. But don't do any gel on this or you're going to need to repair it in the morning. And if you do gel, it's hard. Okay, so like I said, this is not hard. You just have to be methodical about it. So you gotta take you're going to want to part across. And this obviously is a lot easier when they're sitting down. You're going to need to put in a movie or something and just twist all the other hair out of the way. So I just, I went and bought when I was doing it um, just those big clips like they use when you're getting your hair colored, just hold the hair out of the way. Um, depending on the length of their hair, they sell these at any beauty supply different lengths. I kind of like the blue unless their hair is really, really long or really, really thick. If their hair is long and thick, I'd probably go for the yellow, which is the next size up. So, Megan, how, is that like a half inch or is it, how do you know? She's probably going for the um, I'm sure these are from Classy Chassis. Okay. And Angie just going to talk to Angie. She knows. If you live in the Bountiful area of Classy Chassis, if not, Sally's has them too. Um, okay, the biggest trick, don't try to cheat and use too much hair. You'll regret it and you'll be happy that night because it was fast, but the next morning you'll be angry because they won't look right. Okay, um, so this, I've got some pictures here. This little girl's hair is probably, I mean, she's one of those little girls that uses the little tiny elastic and it wraps around like 10 times. She has no hair and her mom was able to, okay. This girl has a little bit more, but still not a ton. I'll pass them around. I promise they work. So if you guys want to, she very kindly brought that to me. Okay, so the first thing, and don't, you're not going to want to gel the whole thing. You just want to do one section at a time. So you just get cheap, cheap gel. Like she got this. I mean, it was probably, what, five bucks for the right. whole thing at Walmart? Yeah. Cheap. Out, tons of alcohol in it gel. Just nasty. Don't go buy expensive. Just nasty gel like that. Um, only thing you have to be careful on if their hair is really, really dark, make sure you get one that doesn't flake. Because they'll get yeah, I see looking. So you just would take the gel right here, comb the entire thing wet with gel. So it's just totally solid. Start at the bottom and make sure you get those ends tucked under so they don't come out later. The first rows, the first couple of curlers are the hardest. Wrap it, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it so it's against the head like this. I'll do a couple so you guys can see. And then you've got to get the long roller pins like this. Okay, and the first one's going to kind of unroll. That's okay. Okay, and then you do the second one. So the good thing about this, if you have other kids in the show, is your work with this one is the night before. The day of, it's really easy. Same thing, you would comb it well with gel. Her hair's pretty easy because it's all the same length. Okay, now this one, I'm going to put a pin in it, in this one. Then I'm also going to, and you'll get, the first time will be the worst, it'll take you forever. You'll get more coordinated as you go. And clip them together. So I'm going to do this whole, so I'm just, I'm rolling the same way every time. Wet with gel.
And I'm sure there's tons of people out there with curlers if they were party girls last year. They're not that expensive, but. Okay, so I'd have done this whole row all the way across. So let me pull this hair out. Just don't try to do too much hair. You don't want it coming off the ends of the curlers because then you get the bad ones. And their dancers, they shut pretty tough heads from having to have buttons. It shouldn't be that traumatic. Okay, so then you're going to start the next row. Same thing. And make sure you really get a couple of good ones behind the ears so they don't look, they don't want scalped. Everyone else has to be scalped, but they don't. And if they have Larry hair, it is a little bit harder. But you can still do it. <laughs> Just a little trail here. So the bottom row, you went out to the left, are you going? I just keep going the same way. I'm way too uncoordinated to roll the other way. Yeah. And you're just going to piggyback it right. I probably could have done a titch more hair, but it'll become like each time you do it, you're going to try to fit more clothes. You're going to be like, oh, that looks really cute. Let's add a few more. Let's I think that little girl in that picture, the mom started out with like 40, and by the end she was up to 60 because, you know, became a personal. Because it's not, it's not hard. And the gel really helps it hold on to the curlers. Okay, so same thing. I draw all the way across, and they just kind of nestle in there. Now, the worst, worst part, does anyone have just crazy thick hair? Okay. Um, the ponytail's going to be really hard for you because she has so much hair. So for any of those with tons and tons of hair, I would take a decent chunk and actually wrap it around the elastic so you don't have to try to do curlers in it. Okay. This, this is the part that you, when you get to this, ever, so you'll have had Three to four rows of curlers, depending on how thick and big our hair is. The ponytail, you still, you have to just keep being patient. Don't use too big a chunk. You're tired by now, you're done. But you've got to try, and it's hard because they're different lengths, but the gel kind of. You've got to try to fan them out. And this you're going to actually want to clip. So then this piece I'm going to do, and I'm actually going to pull them forward. Because if you try to stack them all up, many years ago when I figured out how to do this, we had a student that she was Asian, and she lived here with her dad. So I had to do it. And it was, Valley West was in a phase of ringlets that were, they were half this size. And she had tons of thick hair, and her head was about this big. I think it was 175 curlers I had to roll every night. It was, you guys, it was terrible. And as you know, they would do all theirs back to back to back, so it would be like 10, 30 at night if you roll. But her, she was down at this tall. And her, please remember that hair was coarse. Oh, is this a challenge? I went through two tons of gel this big. So, just the gel. Dry and dirty. Yeah, if you do it wet, they won't work. And even make sure that gel you get has high alcohol content so it'll dry. Because some of those gels don't, you know, the nice ones that don't have alcohol. They'll, their hair will need a trim after that crack of the shoe. A decent trim. <laughs> okay, but you see how you, those just will start piggybacking. And I plan on about two pins per curler. So and so then and so then I would fan that out and then I would fan these ones on top of my row right here. I'd actually snap them to them right here. Okay, so you have this whole thing done. It's all wet with gel. Then you actually buy a decent hairspray that dries quickly. That's not wet. You're going to spray the whole thing with hairspray. 
Uh, put a towel in your lap when you're doing it because you get really. Is it your aerosol or just Oh, aerosol. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, I really, it's really expensive, but I really like that bed head one that comes in the turquoise can. It's really spendy, but it, it dries. Okay, so then you're going to want to get like a granny old lady silky hair mat. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right here. Where do you get those? I think just we got it either when we picked up the jelly. Yeah. Walmart, uh -huh. any, yeah, plastic chassis. You put the whole thing over when they go to bed so that you don't have static electricity. Now, if they have to go to school, they may not want to wear this because it's not as cute. So get a little bandana or something just to tie it. Mostly to hold these bottom ones up because they're going to start to sag. Especially these kids with real small heads. She has a tiny head. Okay, so now it's like, okay, now it's game time. We're getting ready to go to performance. And you're going to have this pitter pattern in your heart because you all this work. Pull the pins. Don't do anything more. Just, you're going to poke. Oh, spray it again before you pull them out. Let it dry. Put their makeup on and then you just, you pull them straight down. Just straight down. Now you can get two or three that just don't work. They're just, they're bad, ugly, nasty. You take these long pins. You curl it up on your finger. Yep, you have everyone that did it last year. You had a couple that just didn't work. And it's just irritating. <laughs> Roll it up. There's so many curls, you just pin it to their head and hide it. You can hide, you can even hide it. Oh, behind. oh you can hide yeah. so much. Because 97% of them are going to work. But there's going to be like three that just, and it's, there's usually one or two up here. And then somewhere in here, there's one that didn't work. Who knows why? Now, here's the big thing. Most of your performances are close enough together. The, le the less hair washes you do, they're going to look spectacular by the end. I had a girl who mom didn't let her wear, wash her hair for a week. Because she just, because her hair, I mean, it took her two hours, the first <coughs> roll. Because she, I mean, it was come home, put the curlers back in, spray it. It will take you one third the time. Put it, pull them out. Or even like, say they have a Saturday performance, they have Sunday off, and then they have Monday again. Make them go to church in their ringlets. Yes. Sunday night, put them back in. Like you don't even have to put them in Saturday night, just, but it will, you will be glad. Don't wash it every time. It, it, you, don't, you don't even get greasy because there's so much spray. You're just kind of gross. So now when you're rolling it, because there's already gel and everything in there, you don't add the gel. You just no. Add and then spray it. And then just spray. Okay. Yeah, and then you just get that layers and layers. Of hair. Now their hair's going to get darker and darker. <laughs> The blondes all said aren't so blonde, but I mean, you, you can see it. I already gave her a little cry. I promise it works. I would practice once, like before sometime, or maybe for the tech, or I don't know. I mean, did you guys practice once before? We, you had us do it for the uh, tech. tech, and then you passed us off. I okay, think. maybe we should do that again. Do you guys want to pass off for tech? Let's do it. I'd say let's let's pass off for tech. Because I can usually help you. I mean, some hair is easier than others. Some hair takes curl that fast. Some hair you really have to work with. Is that yours, Jane? Jane's taking curl. We could put regular curl in. That's how mine is. 9 o'clock in the morning and go to 11 o'clock church. That's how mine is. Yeah, my hair takes curl really easy. It's really fine, but well, you see how that already just starts to work. And so you'll figure out the secrets for your hair, but don't. I had a girl a couple years ago, her mom pulled so much hair behind her ears that it just makes sure there's hair behind the ears here. Okay, so in the more, oh, okay, so when you pull this out, this is going to just be terrible, this front part. Just put some gel on it, take your comb, just comb it all in, spray it, and then you can just take your body pins, because the bows are pretty big, and you can just push them down inside like that and just fix this. Because you can't take the elastic out. And make sure you use a really good elastic that won't break because that's also the worst. Make sense? Questions? No? It's pretty easy. So after I just 